I love you, but the drones gotta go. 12 missiles, two 12.7 mm M2 heavy machine guns, and 35 mm clouds of tungsten. Drones won't stand a chance against DACA like this. A Canadian advanced LAV based Sharad solution for NATO. That doesn't suck. Vehicle based LAV platform, mobility and versatility. The LAV platform remains the ideal choice due to its agility in diverse operational environments, including amphibious capabilities and its adaptability for various mission profiles across NATO member nations. Armor and survivability. Protection is ensured through a remotely operated turret to minimize crew exposure during combat and ensure compliance with CBRN, which stands for Chemical, Biological, Radiological, and Nuclear Safety Protocols. Armament Systems, Primary Gun 35mm Revolver Cannon, also known as Skynex MK3. The revolver cannon is based on the Skynex MK3 using the 35mm Ahead ammunition from Rhine Metal. This German-engineered munition is highly effective against aerial threats, including drones, helicopters, and cruise missiles. Ahead Ammunition Each round of 35mm Ahead releases a cloud of tungsten subprojectiles timed to explode at the optimal distance, increasing lethality against small, fast-moving targets. Rate of fire. For improved shot placement and ammo conservation, the firing rate will be capped, allowing for controlled bursts, maximizing the system's longevity during operations without compromising effectiveness. Mounting and stabilization. The revolver cannon will be mounted in a stabilized turret, providing precision firing even during vehicle movement. The design will include secure attachment points for rapid naval deployment making it viable for both land and sea-based operations. Secondary Armament Dual Coaxial 50 caliber Heavy Machine Guns Purpose These heavy machine guns provide a cost-effective anti-drone solution. Utilizing time-delay fuse ammunition, these rounds will self-destruct after a programmed distance, minimizing collateral damage and ensuring safe operation in urban environments or near civilian infrastructure. Positioning mounted coaxially with the 35mm cannon, the 50 caliber machine guns offer flexibility in engaging both ground and aerial targets at short ranges while ensuring operational safety through the use of time delay fuses. Missile System Stinger Air Defense Launching System or SADALS Missile Armament. The vehicle will be equipped with the Stinger Air Defense Launching System, derived from the LAV AD system, providing a potent layer of medium range air defense. Additional Storage. The vehicle will carry two additional saddles packs internally, allowing for rapid reloading and extending the engagement duration. This increases the vehicle's capacity to sustain operations without the need for external resupply in high threat environments. Total capacity. With the saddles launchers and additional packs stored inside, the vehicle can carry up to 12 Stinger missiles, greatly enhancing its missile endurance. Tracking and targeting systems. Optical tracking, high resolution cameras, and image recognition systems provide the first layer of visual target acquisition. Infrared, or IR, tracking thermal imaging allows the detection of enemy heat signatures, especially useful in low visibility conditions such as fog, smoke, or night operations. Ultraviolet, or UV, tracking UV sensors aid in missile plume detection and improve the system's ability to track fast-moving threats like aircraft or cruise missiles. Passive Radar this system enables the vehicle to detect enemy aircraft without emitting any signals that could reveal its position, enhancing operational stealth and survivability. Remote Operated Turret Design The turret will be remotely operated, allowing for maximum crew safety by keeping personnel inside the armored hull. The turret will be designed to accommodate future upgrades with minimal modification. 
CBRN Compliance By sealing the turret systems, the vehicle will remain fully functional in CBRN environments, keeping the crew safe while engaging threats. Ammunition Production, German, 35mm Ahead, Ammunition Canadian Production License a key part of this proposal is for Canada to secure a production license for the German 35mm AHEAD ammunition. This will Strengthen NATO supply chains By producing the ammunition locally, Canada will be able to contribute directly to NATO's collective defence, ensuring faster resupply and reduced dependency on non-local suppliers. Cost Reduction Canadian production will reduce the overall cost of fielding this advanced shored system by eliminating the need for costly imports. It will also position Canada as a strategic partner for ammunition supply during times of conflict. Modular Adaptation and Naval Capability Naval Deployment The vehicle will be equipped with secure attachment points for deployment aboard ships allowing it to function as a SHORAD system for naval defense. This capability makes it an excellent choice for littoral and expeditionary missions. Modular Systems The system will be designed with modularity in mind, allowing future upgrades to sensor arrays, weaponry, or additional systems like active protection. Conclusion this proposal presents a high-value, multi-role, lab shored system that delivers in spades. Cost Efficiency With the inclusion of 50 caliber HMGs for anti-drone capabilities using time-delay fuse ammunition and local production of 35mm ahead ammunition, the system provides a cost-effective solution for both ground and aerial defense. NATO Synergy by securing a license to produce AHEAD ammunition, Canada can contribute to NATO's defense logistics while reducing dependence on overseas suppliers. Versatility. Whether deployed on land or at sea, this shored platform offers a flexible solution that can adapt to different mission requirements, including naval support. Extended missile capability. The integration of the Stinger Air Defense Launching System from the LAV AD and the additional internal packs boosts missile capacity, ensuring longer operational endurance in high threat environments. Future proofing. The system's modular design ensures that it can evolve alongside emerging threats and technologies, ensuring it remains relevant for decades to come. This SHORAD system would serve as a premier option for NATO forces, offering unmatched protection, flexibility, and cost-effectiveness. Stay strong, stay safe, and keep shining even from the shade.